City leaders are preparing to host a community meeting on Thursday to tackle the growing problem of violence and crime in Stockton. Organizers plan to meet in the morning, but some activists are asking for some additional forums to be added. CBS 13's Carlos Correa reports concerned citizens want to be heard. Since the recent number of homicides in Stockton over the last three weeks, case managers and fathers and families of San Joaquin have been busy helping those impacted by the violence and crime. The cases that have impacted me the most that I carry home with me are often of homicides and shootings. The agency works to strengthen families with programs focused on youth empowerment and leadership. It also centers on violence prevention. The community members are the ones that are affected by it, you know. A lot of the officials aren't affected by it. The city is hosting a community meeting Thursday from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. about what to do about all the crime and violence. But activists say it needs to be at a better time so everyone can participate. If we're having a community meeting where the community is not showing up and you're having it at a time that is not conducive for the community to show up, who really are they reaching out to? The manager of the Office of Violence Prevention, which organizes the Community Engagement Coalition meetings, say they did have a couple of meetings in the evenings, but only had a handful of people show up. And we did advertise it. Um, our community engagement coordinator went around and spoke to people, and we still just didn't get the turnout. We seem to get the most bang for our buck, 9 from 11. Organizers do plan on handing out an evaluation during the meeting with questions to help get more participation and to find out if there's a need to change the time for concerned citizens. I want them to be able to become more involved, more engaged, and really wanting people to get on board and join their efforts. The violence prevention meeting is set to take place at the Civic Auditorium in downtown Stockton on Thursday morning.